Okay, so this is the re unboxing of the Acaso Ultra HD 4K action camera. Let's see what they've sent us. This is the box, which contains a nice picture of a youth running through the countryside. And I hope that as a result of me having this camera, I also can run through the countryside. So let's look at the box. It tells us a little bit about it. Two inch display, 170 degree view, waterproof to 98 feet. Should I ever go underwater to 98 feet? In the back we've got a specification that tells me it has an integrated wireless network. Super wide angle lens. Presumably that doesn't mean the lens is super, it's just that the angle is super. Uh, 2.4G remote control included. Well, why didn't they give me a 2.5G? Uh, display is 2 inch LCD, so that's nice, isn't it? We do like a nice 2 inch LCD display. Uh, storage, micro SDHC card, which has not been included. Cheapskates. Mounts and accessories included, uh, input, output, micro USD, blah, blah, blah. And it tells me that it has a photo, battery, waterproof, wireless, multi-language, happy days. And there's a nice thing here which has lots of different colour listed, but of course it doesn't tell me which colour this particular product is. And on the other side we've got it says, this is a remote control. Uh, wireless etc. Let's have a look and see exactly what we've got. Now let's open up the package. Let's open this. Let's see what they've sent me. Let's go through it now. Okay, so cellophane comes off. That means that nobody has tried to tamper with my product. We've got a little thing here which is holding it in place. Let's open that and let's see what they've given me. Hmm. Cardboard box, nice bit of recycling inside, fold it back. What do we have in here? First of all, we have got something that slides out like this. And we get bits of plastic, which I'm sure cannot be recycled. And that's the end of the box. And now we're inside here, I've got ah, two more bits of plastic which cannot be recycled, and here we have a box made of cardboard with a little camera on top uh, screwed in somehow. No instructions on how to get here with that. Let's see what's in the box. Oh, look, we have, we have something that says getting started. Let's have a look and see what the getting started guide says. It says first peel off the films on the camera screen camera lens and the waterproof case. Make sure the battery is full of power for the first time use. Format your micro SD card, which is not included, firstly in the camera before using. And of course, obviously where they have not spent their money is, uh, they have spent their money in uh, product design, they have not spent it in translation to English. They should pay me and I will use my link cunning linguistic skills. So, top of the list, we've got a little plastic something. No idea what that does. Looks like a cover. Let's leave it there. I've got a little box. Presumably that's a battery. Oh, look at this. I've got something that looks like it's a uh, mount. That looks like a little tripod mount. Happy days. What's this? Don't know what that is. We'll see in a second. Uh, got some, another doofer. And we've got, ah, we've got something that looks like you screw it in to the side. Uh, we've got, oh, how nice, little um, cable ties. And what looks like um, bits of sticky back felt and a little pad to wipe things. I do like a nice cloth to wipe down my lenses. So it's a nice touch. Thank you for that. What else do we have in the box? Ah, another little plastic bag. They do love their plastic bags with, um, I don't know what that does. No idea. 
Who knows? Oh, here we've got a little plastic bag containing some straps. And I shall look forward to having these straps put on the camera. In the box we have more plastic bags, which I'm sure are not recyclable, but I'm sure they can be reused. Uh, we have a little mount which has a um, something useful, I'm sure. We've got what looks like a tripod mount. We've got uh, something that says you have to throw it away and do not eat it. I always wonder what happens if you do actually eat it. Not good things, I imagine. We've got a strap, and made of plastic, got some Velcro or hook and loop, if you prefer. Uh, there's a plastic lens cover. Ah, this must be the controller. So I imagine that you push the red button for red things, and you push the grey button for grey things. Oh, they do think of everything, don't they? What else do we have? We've got another mount with rather strange proportions. I've got a little card that tells me the Asa Akasoko Club. Whatever the Asasoko Club is, I have no idea. Um, gives me benefits of warranty extension, 12 months, so presumably they think their product is needs a warranty extension and their product will fail. I do hope not. Priority and personalised customer service. Don't quite know why they think I need customer service. Maybe they think their product is going to fail. Up to 50% off exclusive coupon for the next purchase. Happy days. And a free trial of new release product. La la la. Well, that's nice. And we've got a cable that looks to me like a USB, what's that? Is that C2 micro or something? Uh, we've got more mounts. I don't know quite, again what they do, but there are more of these mounts. And now we have got a... Ah, this looks like something you can clip to your bag or clothing and have the camera go with you. Now we've got one more thing after this we've got a, another mount with a screw on it and finally we've got a piece of paper and this piece of paper with a bit of luck will tell me what to do. So first thing it says is get hold of a mobile telephone. Go to the app store and do something. Presumably you have to download an app to make this thing work. Um, Number two is uh, some arrows coming off the top of uh, the uh, camera. So presumably you open this, uh, camera goes in, remove the case, looks like a battery charger. I didn't remember seeing a battery charger, maybe it's one of those things down here. Oh, battery charges up, blah, blah, blah. Um, battery in the top card in the side. Um, I guess that's the universal symbol for power, so that probably turns it on. And there's a button here that turns it into a camera. Let's see what else it says. Ah, user manual. F click on the QR code for the user manual or go to user manual or go to Google and type in user manual for the EK7000. Contact us for any uh, Queries, and then we have the same text, but in languages that are not English, as apparently that's a thing. Quick start guide on the back. Happy days. So there we are. That is the whole thing unboxed. Now, how, on the name of goodness, do I get this off this thing? I have absolutely pulled that off, and that comes off. That's that's nice, isn't it? Um, I have absolutely no idea. Well, maybe you turn this. Shall we try it and see what happens? Oh, can't turn that. Oh, I don't know. Uh, maybe this comes off. I have absolutely no idea. 
uh, looks like it's locked in place. I do not know how very confusing and very annoying. Is that squeeze? No, that doesn't come off. No. Okay, well that little plastic rubber thing comes off. Happy days. And ah, you can squeeze that. And what does that do if I squeeze it? Anything or nothing. Looks like it should and squeeze and come out if I squeeze it. But for the love of goodness, I cannot, for the life of me, figure out how it is that that thing comes off. Am I supposed to pull it? Am I supposed to bend it? Am I supposed to turn it? Uh, squeeze it? I don't know. Does that pull off? That doesn't pull off. Does that bend? That doesn't bend. Maybe I could try turning it. Oh, it turns. Let's see what that does. Turn. Oh, it's still turning. Good grief. What you would do if you don't have opposable thumbs when you're trying to open this. I do not know anyway, so here we go, it unscrews. Right. Okay. Okay, so that bit comes off. Oh, I better look after that because I'm sure it's going to be needed. Uh, oh, and the camera falls off the, this now. Is that a mount? that I need to keep, or is that just something that goes on the box? You know, I have absolutely no idea. It looks like, I don't know. So, I suspect it's the display case, but there's absolutely no way of knowing. It doesn't look like it's going to come off, but, oh, maybe it is, maybe that squeezes. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Ah, there we are. So, if in doubt, break the thing. There we are. Um, now I have to go and put this back in because, of course, that was the wrong thing to do. And presumably that goes in here now. And I have to remember how that went so that I can fit it back in at a later date. Good grief. Right, OK. So that goes in here. What else do we have on the back? We've got the getting, let's read the getting started guy. Peel off the films, make sure the battery is full of power. Your SD card, right? Okay, so how does this open? Ah, there we are. That opens, pull it back. Yep, nice, nice, nice. Oh, and that opens. Yeah, nice. Now, now I can presumably get the little thing out, and there it is. So, here it is. Uh, I've got f more of this disposable film stuff. Um, uh, we've got on one side, we've got uh, USB connectors, uh, happy days, they look nice. Uh, we've got a slot for some slotty thing. Uh, we've got a little TV screen on the back and something that says remote, which presumably means remote control. It doesn't mean um, you are distant. Uh, there's an F, which I suspect means you're going to have fun. Uh, and it says action camera, and then it's got some numbers which look like serial numbers underneath, and I don't understand what that means. And a little button to push, and uh, it doesn't do anything, and a little button on the front. And presumably this lights up red, so that people know that you're spying on them. So um, maybe we will see if we can cover that up, so we can do covert spying on people who otherwise would prefer that we didn't. Um, yeah, there we go. So let's um, have a quick look at the recap of what else we've got. So I've got the little blue box. I think I would have preferred it in black. That's a little bit um, overt, isn't it? People will see that and know that I'm spying on them. Got a cardboard box, which would be nice. Keep all the bits in it. So let's put that in the cardboard box along with the uh, bit of cardboard and a uh, little polystyrene. Expanded polystyrene. And let's look at what we have in here. We have got, um, right, so now I have a little look around. So that's a clip, so you can clip that onto your uh, onto your ears, if that's what you want. Um, we've got a little USB cable. I'm going to leave that in this bag because they like to live in bags. Uh, we've got more of this stuff in plastic bags. And for the love of Jesus, Mary and Joseph, right, what does that do? Nobody knows. Um, it does something, I'm sure, but nobody really knows what it does. Let's put that in the box. So we've got, oh, the, the club card. Keep your club card. Uh, we've got the uh, thing that presumably goes on your wrist. Um, we've got these mounts. So I will have a quick look at the mounts and see what they are. Oh, my Lord. 
they don't make it easy to see, do they? Okay, so let's have a look. Oh, we've got um, what looks like it's adhesive, and presumably you need something to stick it onto. Um, so you need to find somebody to stick it onto. Um, we've got this. Well, I think I might have to keep that together because as soon as I take that out, I'm going to lose the pieces. But it looks like they go on some sort of mount. Um, there's the strap, so the remote control, I suspect, goes into the strap. But zero points for nil point for uh, explanations. And we've got another one of these. Shall I take it out? No, it's not in there. Um, and I've got yet another one. Uh, again, I have absolutely no idea what it does. But I'm sure that it will do something really useful. And I will only find out the minute I lose it. Ah, that looks like a handlebar connector. So, if I had handlebars, I would be able to connect this to the handlebars. Oh, it looks like I've got that little plastic in there. Keep it soft. Screw that in place. Oh, I can see that becoming a joy and a delight. Uh, if I ever buy an SD card. Aha! Now, what do we have in here? Now we have... Oh, that must be the battery charger. Look at that, it's a USB battery charger. Of course, I don't come with a wall socket. That would be far too useful. I have to phone buy my own wall socket and uh, little straps. I'll hang on to those. Um, another of these mounts. I mean, they love these little mounts, don't they? I have no idea what that one does. Ah, my favourite thing of all, little cloth to give it an old buff and wipe it down. You do need to wipe down your camera. Uh, finally, we've got um, a case. Presumably, that's a spare case for the existing camera. Let's have a quick look. There's the camera or a case. Maybe it's a spare one. I don't know. It looks like it's the similar size, doesn't it? It looks like it could be the same. Uh, oh, yeah, it looks like it could be the same. I don't know why they would give me a second one. Maybe they think that their product is such inferior quality that it's going to fall apart. Right, what's this little device in here? This little device looks like a battery. And I've got two of those. Oh, there's a little something there. I wonder what happens if you pull that. Emergency rip cord. Caution, charge only the charger. Don't dispose of it in fire. Don't. It doesn't say don't eat it, so um, presumably I can eat it. And there's a little thing here to... I don't know, maybe you pull that? I don't know, maybe that's to help get you out of a situation. I don't know. Ah, oh, there's my silica gel. I'm going to have that in a, a bit of ice cream later. And um, we've got some more of this. And uh, finally got one of those. Okay, so that is it. That is my unboxing of the great product that is this thing here. The Akazo camera um, and uh, they have a picture of a youth running through the country and I hope that now that I have this camera I shall be compelled to run everywhere I go and I shall develop a physique that reminds me of this fellow with sticks. So, happy days. Thanks very much.